and the people from like like they don't even go school. Yeah. I'm from Taiwan and Taiwan is like a really really tiny island like next to China yeah. and there's four of us my mom was my dad's secretary and that's how they met yeah this is my dad and this is my grandma mm -hmm. and this is my mom my parents they love to travel when we were when we were little kids they like to take <laughs> us everywhere this is me and my grandma <laughs> we went to Japan to but it's just coming over here like I don't really have somebody to do to do that with me so I kind of miss my family Yvonne, like many other international students, had a difficult decision to make as to leaving her home country to attend BYU-Idaho. I wasn't an active member over there. And my whole family, they weren't, they weren't, they aren't active right now. And I can see like the different standard like, that we have as a member of the church and outside of the world. And it's just come to the point I need to decide like what life I want to have. And if I'm if I should keep being a member of church or should I just, you know, just do what I want. So I prayed about it and I started reading the Book of Mormon for the first time in my life. And I received my an answer that I need to go serve a mission. And one of the reasons I want to come over here is because I want to be in that environment again. <laughs> it was hard in the beginning, but I feel like for like most of the international students because if this is like their first time of being here in America, they will always need some time to adjust to the environment. And they probably will have lots of questions, but they don't know how to ask. Or sometimes they just need somebody to, to think about them and to, to care about them. Coming to BYU-Idaho can be difficult for many of these international students. With many of their classmates and friends headed home to their families for the holidays, international students can be left without much needed support. I feel like if people can reach out to them and they just ask like if there's if there's anything that they can help with like that will like mean the world to them. When my companion invited me to her house for Thanksgiving, I was like, oh, yay! <laughs> Although like I'm I'm trying to be cool like yeah I would love to that would be so fun but like inside I was like really happy like I have somewhere to go and like a family to be a part with. And I feel like for Christmas season, it is hard for for most of the international students because like like you said, we are so far away from our family. So like maybe just do something with them and just talk to them about your family. I think that would really help and have them sh and share their culture with you and share their, the things they like to do with your family. And as Yvonne has learned, being that friend can make all the difference. Like now I can see like, why family is so important, like, I just don't really want to, like, be so far away from them. But I, I also know, like, coming over here is the right decision to make. From BYU-Idaho, this is Stefan Laird, Scroll TV News.